Columns carry the load of the structure and hence they are critical. It is important to align them for verticality so that load is transmitted properly. The column shuttering should be strong enough to take the pressure of fresh concrete and remain in position during concreting. Here are some tips on column shuttering. To hold the concrete shuttering firmly in place with proper alignment, a concrete pad called starter is cast before fixing the shuttering. The thickness is about 45 mm to 60 mm and dimensions are precisely the same as the dimensions of the proposed column. The starter should be cured for a day or two so that it is hard enough to fix the shuttering around it. Column box or shuttering for columns is made of plywood sheets or steel sheets fabricated with adequate stiffeners. A thin film of oil or grease should be applied to the inner surface of the shuttering to enable easy removal of the column after the concrete hardens. Shuttering should be properly aligned to its verticality and diagonals should be checked to ensure accuracy in dimensions. It has to be thoroughly supported with props or ties before pouring the concrete so that it does not move horizontally or vertically during concreting. The gaps near the shutter joints should be sealed to prevent any leakage of slurry. Appropriate space is to be provided between the inner face of the shutter and reinforcement by fixing cover blocks. It is preferable to remove the shutters after 24 hours of casting and they need to be removed earlier. It should not be before 16 hours. The removal of shutters has to be done gently and without jerks or hammering so that the edges of the columns are not damaged. Care should be taken regarding column shuttering. Starter should be built to hold the shuttering and prevent it from movement. Diagonals of the shuttering should be checked to ensure dimensional accuracy. Gaps at shutter joints should be sealed and cover blocks placed. Ensure that shuttering does not move while concreting.